Well, just emphasizing basics. Uh, I like to get a lot of skill acquisition. Uh, just taking a look at each individual and seeing what they can do, what they can learn, uh, and really trying to improve them day by day. So um, it's been really good. They've been very responsive. They've been really open to adjustments and change. Uh, very uh, alert about you know anything that they can do to, that makes them better, faster. Um, so the team morale has been great. The, eff uh, the effort and the energy has been high. Uh, so we're really focusing on, we've got some great athletes here, and really focusing on taking their swimming and their technique uh, to the next level. So we've worked a lot of fundamentals, but a lot of skill, skill work that's really going to hopefully pay off. Well, they're, they're, they've got a lot of differences, a lot of different backgrounds, but they're very close. They're very uh, Nevada committed. Um, they are like one pack, uh, and they are all about the team. They realize that from an early, early, early on in the uh, semester, we've talked about the team being one. We're only as good as our weakest link. We are going to rely on all 19 swimmers and uh, two divers to compete at their best ability um, and really contribute every meet. So uh, the most important thing for, for that is that they, they buy in and they're all about the team. So we've really worked on and what I've found is that you know they, they come with a great disposition, they come with a positive attitude. They're excited about the challenges that the coaching staff are, are going to give them that day. Uh, and they see that this is all building blocks for the success of the year. Well, I think anytime you have uh, you know, the, the reigning uh, Mountain West Swimmer of the week, Year in Yao Wen, and obviously the, the reigning Mountain West Diver of the Year in Krista, it's a great uh, you know, boost to the team to know that they're not done. Usually the kids that win those events, are, it's their senior year, it's their swan song, and, and they go off into, into the big world. And for us, we're fortunate enough that they were awesome swimmers and divers in their junior years and years past. So they're coming back for their senior year. They've probably got even more higher goals um, and they want to lead their team. For the rest of the team, we've got a great supporting cast. Uh, you know, had it not been for those those two athletes, maybe some of our other girls would have vied for, you know, conference swimmer of the year. Um, and so we've got a great supporting cast, a great group of juniors and sophomores that are right on their heels, uh, that are trying to seize the moment, and uh, they're ready to be, uh, you know, to be led by those those seniors. Well, we're excited to get started. We, you know, we've really been uh, training in that, in the pool for for it seems like eight weeks now. Um, and we're tired of racing each other and competing against each other. So we're, great, we're excited about the great opportunity to, to move outside uh, of campus and to, to go to the University of Pacific. Uh, they put on an invite where it's a two-day invite. It's Friday night at 7 and Saturday morning at 10. And um, we have basically Pacific is hosting it and then uh, Fresno State, San Jose State, Fresno Pacific is going to be there. Um, there'll also be some other teams on the men's side too, but really it's going to be five, five teams. Uh, and that'll be a great indicator for us. Obviously, a couple of those teams are Mountain West, so we'll get to see them for the first time. Uh, and like I said, I think the girls are excited to, uh, you know, to go somewhere different and, and compete you know, for, for the Wolfpack. Well, I think obviously being in the Mountain West and, and finishing third last year, you always want to look up. So our goals are for you know, individual development and, and success and improvement. Uh, and then obviously we, if we do that, if we get everyone to contribute and, and increase uh, their ability to score, then the team will do that much better too. We can't really control what the other teams do. All we can do is make the most of every day we have. Um, and obviously beyond that, if we, if we try to be faster in every event, then, we've got, then we're in a position where our relays and more individuals can maybe qualify for the NCAA championships. So uh, obviously <clears throat> for us to finish you know, in, in, the top, you know, in the top 35 last year at the NCAAs was, was a great improvement. Um, but really, if we can get three, four more girls there and a couple, couple of relays there and, and maybe one extra diver, then we have a chance to break into the top 25. So uh, that obviously is, a, is a, maybe a team goal for us, but it, it starts with each individual and, and we're really looking for their improvement. And then if we do that and everyone improves, then it opens up the opportunity to have a goal in the Mountain West Conference and then obviously goals at the NCAA Championships.